previously on The Walking Dead. Who do you think did this? Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? What's the most important thing in this world? Clem, it's family. People like Matthew aren't coming back. Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. Ah! Go to hell, you f We're going home. As a family. done over there yeah one second thanks for coming with me it's scary out here I know they made you it's still nice that you came we're friends friends look out for one another we are aren't we well if you need to pee let me know I'll keep look out for you too uh okay Everything come out all right, girls? Troy, get them tied up. Will do. Well, we're on our way. Probably 30 minutes out. Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carver out. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk back. Nope. Froze my ass off. Just like you told me to. It ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. Has anyone ever taught you that? Where's your manners? No, stop! Don't hit my friend! You don't want to test me, girl. I'll pass every time. Leave her alone! Tie her up and throw her in with the rest of them. In. Are you guys okay? The hell did he do to you? Hey! Did he hurt you? Hey! Hey! We gotta do something. Come on. Anyone got anything sharp? Anything? We need to get these bindings off. Hey, Clem, help me find something to get these off. Anything sharp that could cut these. And what good is that gonna do? The hell is wrong with you people? We gotta get out of here. Hey, are you listening to me? What's the matter with you? We're in a fucking precarious position here. We gotta do something about Settle that. Settle down, Kenny. They took everything. We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill? This whole time it's Carver, Carver, Carver. Now he's fucking Bill? Oh, I see what it is. Y'all are just getting a ride home, aren't you? That's what's going on here. 
Say that again. I'd stay out of this, boy. Mister, I ain't a boy. No, right. You're a man. You don't understand. He's different. It's worse. The fuck are you talking about? He wants to punish us. You could have warned us. Yeah, you didn't tell us he was a fucking psychopath. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, he gave me a pretty good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that happen to the rest of us. I'm trying to help! I'm sure Walter really appreciated your help. That's not fair. You're blaming him for the actions of a madman. I am pointing out that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Something that he seems to be misreading as capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying, but I know it's bullshit. We have to do something. Kenny, you can't reason with him. Oh shit. Jackpot. Sit down. You're going to get us all killed. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know that. Yeah? Well, I've been in this situation before. You ever been a prisoner? Stop fighting! Please. All right. Now we're talking. Carver will be on the other side of that door with ten people. <laughs> there, there, baby. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. <sighs> At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. If he was gonna do something, he'd have done it by now. Who knows what he's dealing with? Anything can happen out there. I'll tell you what happened. He abandoned us. You don't know that. I know he ain't here. He may not be around, but he wouldn't just leave us behind. That guy's a flake. I could tell the second I set eyes on him. We'll have to wait and see. It's all we can do. She's right. There's no way to know what's happened to him. I told you already. He's gone. Close. Okay, let's do this. They have guns. What exactly do you expect to do? I'm gonna punch the first son of a bitch I see. Then I'm gonna take his gun and use it to shoot the next son of a bitch I see. Just sit down. Shut up, Doc. This ain't your call. Hey, just, if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't, you know, get yourself hurt or nothing, but any help would be good. Hey, Clem, look at me. You trust me, right? Kenny, please, just... Just listen to them. They know him. What he's capable of. Maybe we should wait. Maybe come up with a different plan. I... Okay, hon. That's okay. That's okay. All right. Everybody run! Kenny! Uh, Kenny, are you okay? Is he okay? I think so. Oh, what hit me? It's probably for the best. Goddamn brakes ain't working for shit. All right, up and at him. The fuck? How'd you get your restraints off? Come here. We've got some familiar faces back with us tonight. Now, I understand some of you are confused as to why we bring these people back when they left us as they did. I think I've got an idea. Now, it might not come all at once, but time will heal these wounds. Patient with them until it does. You take solace in knowing that they're here to help us make our home a better place. All these feelings you have of anger, betrayal, hate, they're all valid. No one needs to forget what they did, but we do have to find it in our hearts to forgive them. Look how much food they have. Oh, I hope you ain't saying what I think you're saying. Many of you already know a large herd of lurkers gathers just south of us. Come on, we we'll need you for something. Can it wait until morning? We're all exhausted. Just come the fuck on. Turn our way. It's nothing we can't handle. Some I need him. I need my dad. I, I can't. He's... He looks after me. They have been taken into consideration. However, this is not up for debate. The expansion project... Grow up, Sarah. You're gonna get us in trouble. I don't care. And don't tell me to grow up. You're just a little kid. I'm older than you. You're the one that got hit. And with the added manpower joining us this evening, I have no doubt that we will continue Make sure y'all stay off the fence. Bill can save no you if you're messing enough. with it. Just to survive, it's our obligation to make this community 
Thanks, Barney. Yep. To provide a light, a bright light, bright enough to shine in all this darkness. So that is what we'll do. Y'all best get some rest, because there ain't gonna be much for you tomorrow. You're gonna be working hard. That's for you. Yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold, but at least I'll be comfortable. Hey, guys. Reggie! <gasps> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What did they do to you? This could have been worse, trust me. I'm lucky to be alive. It's my fault. No, it's really not. I would tell you if it was. This happened well after you guys left. I guess I should say Reggie nice helped us you, but when we ran away. I know. I feel the same way. Why didn't he go with you guys when you left? I think maybe he was supposed to, but then he fell, and everybody kept running. I know he had both his arms then. They got me working outside. Lurker snuck up on me while I was hammering something. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Look, it was my choice to help you guys. Alvin, Carver wants you in his office. What? Why? Don't make this difficult. It's too late for that. No, please. It's okay, Beck. Just get some rest. If he wanted to do something to me, he'd have done it already. I'll be fine. Let's see what he wants. Hey, Reggie. Oh, hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. Don't mention it. All right, let me introduce you. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's Sarita. Hello. And that's Kenny. Hey. Uh... Hello. Who are you? This freaks you out. It's okay. Freaks me out too sometimes. My name's Clementine. It's very nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, where's Carlos? Bill's already got him looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? Can you guys save it for the morning? Some of us gotta be up early. Who's that? I don't know. I don't recognize the voice. No problem. Sorry about that. Okay, that's Mike. He's kind of a dick when he's tired, but... Like I said, he saved my life, so... I put up with that shit. Bill put him to work outside the wall with me. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, he said once you were all caught, he'd let me rejoin the group, so... I'm glad you're here. I'm just joking. I know. I mean, he did say that. But... I'm not happy about it. It's probably bullshit. Who's she? Hmm? Who? The girl over there? Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so she's fucking weird. They found her sneaking around outside the camp covered in guts and just, like, the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stare. I know how it must look, but it's really not that bad here. Reggie. No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff, and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh food. The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced labor, but that's only temporary. They've even got the solar panels working. When was the last time you had electricity, huh? Well, we just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, it's not as bad as you think. We're building something great here, guys. A real community. Bill is making it happen. Look, I've made mistakes, and he's forgiven me. That doesn't make up for what he's done, Reggie. I know that, but I'm starting to see what this place offers. I didn't before, and with the accident, it's just that much more important now. It feels more like a prison. Well, that is a very negative attitude. She's right, Reggie. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? 
What do you think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please just try not to cause any trouble? At least until they release me. Then, once I'm out, I could help you more. Maybe even help get you out. We won't get you in trouble. They're expecting me to keep things in line out here. Well, if Carver's such a great guy, I'm sure you've got nothing to worry about. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night and chat again tomorrow. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Look, the fact is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all gone, but he's given me a second chance, and I know he'd do the same for you. Reggie, I don't want a second chance. I want to leave with my family. That's it. Your family is safer here. <gasps> I need to sit down. Yeah, come on. Sarah, can you go see if there's something for her to drink? Okay. Yeah, there's water over by the benches. Ah, that didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Man, fuck that guy. I don't think we can trust him. I mean, clearly he's already drank too much of the Kool-Aid. I think he's just scared. Everybody's scared. Ain't an excuse to sound like a nutcase. You gotta take a look around. We gotta know if there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. We're in a tight spot. Gonna have to wriggle our way out. Sure, I'll have a look around. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference on him. Walker just snuck up on you, huh? Yep, I was uh, distracted. Just wasn't thinking. There's all kinds of noise, hammering and stuff. I saw its shadow. It moved in front of one of our work lamps down here and knocked it over. Couldn't even see for a second. That's when it got me. Can't believe you survived. I can't either, honestly. It might kill the walker. I saw a fella try that a few months ago. Just ended up bleeding out. Ended up turning anyway. Yeah, like I said, it felt like Mike had done it before. He had a tourniquet on me real quick. <clears throat> hey, Clem, come on. Don't be like that. She ain't doing nothing wrong, Reggie. Just relax. How can I relax when she's walking around touching everything? Clementine, please. I asked really nicely. I don't want hey, to... what the hell is she doing? No, uh, nothing. <laughs> you know, kids. They love not listening. You had one job, Reggie. This is real disappointing. Gonna have to tell Bill about this. Please, come on. Hey, don't be like that, man. You shut your fucking mouth. I don't know you. Oh, you all fucked up now. Bill's gonna hear about this shit. Troy, please. Fuck you, Reggie. This is setting you back a few. Get comfortable, asshole. He was trying to help. She's just a kid. No one's talking to you, Indian lady. Hey! It's fine. I am Indian. Everybody get to bed. Some of these folks ain't too keen on leaving. It's up to us to figure out a way out of here. You up for it?
It's your decision. I'll try. You'll do just fine. Now get some sleep. We'll need it. Don't kick me. It's rude. Get up. Bale's gonna have a word. There's been increased walker activity along the fence, so be mindful when outside the walls. The herds moved a little closer as of this morning, but that still doesn't necessarily mean we'll be hit. No, we're monitoring the situation. Now... There are some folks might be sore about what happened, and how things went. Well, that's all in the past now. Some of you are new to our community. Some of you are members who went astray. But know that you can find redemption here, forgiveness, by proving your worth through what will undoubtedly be hard work. Now, Reggie slipped up last night, but that doesn't mean he should lose hope. Today will be a test for him. So let's all wish him the best of luck. How'd you sleep? I'll let Reggie be an example I to you all. So tired. Salvation is available, but it I didn't must even be earned. That. Kenneth Shut will be up. taking over Reggie's well, duties don't outside have to the wall. Rude about it. Michael will continue on I showing just his it was value. Nice to finally... Carlos! Yes? Your child seems to be in need of correction. I'm sorry. I... Sarah, apologize to Mr. Carver. S I'm sorry, sir. No, no. That ain't gonna cut it. I can't have this kind of behavior on day one of your reform. You discipline her now, Carlos. How do you propose that one I... One good smack across the mouth should do it. It'll make her think twice before opening it up again. Go on, we'll wait. My... I'm not sure with my hand that I... Well, could... that's why you got two hands, Carlos. Come on! Not some namby-pamby thing, all right? A good hard smack. Otherwise, Troy here will do it for you. I don't think you want that. He can be... overzealous. Is that the word? If it means I'll slap the shit out of her, then yeah. Go on, Carlos. Just get it over with. No, you don't need to do that. She's already scared. She won't do it again. Hey, no one's fucking talking to you. Unless you want one of what she's about to get, I'd pipe down, Missy. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm Close sorry. Close your eyes, honey. It's only going to sting for a second. Do it. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. Stop! You're not coddling that girl anymore. Let her sit there and think about what she's done. Troy, get Carlos to his post. Everyone else should have their assignments. It's time to get to work. God damn. You really knocked the shit out of her, Doc. Everyone get to work. You're working in the armory. Follow me. Soil, coming up! God damn this thing. Oh, shit. Clementine! Who is this? She's one of the new people. She was with Carlos and Sarah. Ugh, and... Sarah? I wish she'd stayed gone. She's had a hard time, Becca. So have we. We're not sitting on the ground like babies. Go on inside. Bonnie's waiting.
Hey, I guess you're starting your day with me. We're loading magazines. Well, that's it. You got it. I suppose I owe you an apology. I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge, and I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. But now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. I truly believe that was the intent. At least it was mine going into it. Carver's the one who pulled the trigger. He's to blame. Yeah, but I surely didn't help matters. I thought if I was the one that found everyone, I could control it. Keep everyone safe. But that ain't how it went. I apologize. Which don't account for much, but it's all I can offer right now. How was your first night in the yard? I know it ain't so comfortable, but... It's safe. Which is more than I can say about a lot of places out there. You mean my first night in prison? It ain't a prison. More of a work release. Didn't they do those in prisons? Well, I... Probably. I don't know. I've never been to prison. Don't tell no one. I'm trying to keep a tough reputation. I was supposed to go. When Luke and Carlos and all them left, I was planning on leaving too. When Luke approached me about it, I, I thought he was crazy. I mean, we're safe here. We got power, we got food. And Bill, he... He wasn't always like this. They never mentioned you. No? Hmm. Huh. Uh, not even Luke? Well, I mean, that's to be expected, ain't it? You don't know me, do you? What are they gonna say? Well, Bonnie ain't here. He wouldn't know what he was talking about. I guess that could be it. I justified not going by telling myself it's easier to try and change something that's broken than start all over. Take this situation with the herd? That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. He keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to be somewhere comfortable for a while. Nobody's safe here with Carver around. You're safe if you stay on his good side. I would if I knew where it was. I mean, it ain't easy keeping a group this big fed and protected. I don't envy that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. I'm not defending what he did. That was... <sighs> I'm alive because of him. That's just a fact. I think he's crazy. He's... <sighs> he's... <sighs> Overstressed. It's easier to just say crazy. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they didn't line up with what Bill was thinking. They butted heads, then Rebecca started showing, and that only made things worse. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? I need to come get her. Yeah, she's here. Okay, I'll be right over. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, almost forgot. I grabbed this for you. Huh? What do you think? I found it at the lodge y'all were at. Think it might be for scan. Had to wait for no one to be around to get it to you. I don't know. Oh, you don't like it. it it's not that. I thought it was kind of cute. Well, this ain't a fashion show. It'll keep you warm. You better watch yourself. I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. Oh, there you are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia! What? Never mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Come on. 